From plants and animal life to our own human well-being, we all rely on healthy ecosystems as they provide a multitude of essential benefits. However, the impacts of climate change devastate the intricate balance of our ecosystems, creating volatile environments. Maintaining balance in our ecosystems is a critical part of the global solution to climate change, as healthy ecosystems build resilience within our communities. This solution, called Ecosystem-Based Adaptation, or EBA for short, restores and protects the health of ecosystems to, in turn, ensure the long-term sustainability for people and the planet. To maximize EBA uptake and benefits, it's imperative to integrate its methods into a country's national adaptation plan, also known as an app. For example, Fiji and Timor-Leste are effectively scaling up EBA through the NAP processes with three key actions. Let's take a closer look. By identifying EBA as a strategic priority in their NAPs, both Fiji and Timor-Leste recognize that efforts to protect, maintain and restore nature will support people, livelihoods and biodiversity. Adaptation is inherently local. Looking at Fiji's NAP, the engagement of all levels of government and civil society throughout the adaptation planning process provides an important opportunity to integrate EBA into local and regional adaptation plans. This helps deliver ecosystem services equitably and makes decision-making more inclusive. Traditional ecological knowledge and local practices can strengthen EBA planning. A participatory approach allows for a social buy-in from those whose livelihoods depend on healthy ecosystems. For example, Timor-Leste is encouraging community participation through an indigenous system of law and resource management called Tarabandu to promote long-term climate-responsive prosperity. To learn more about how Fiji and Timor-Leste have mainstreamed EBA into their NAP processes, visit NAP Global Network dot org